Nicole Scott here from Mobile Geeks and here we are at CBIT 2013. We have a Haswell Ultrabook prototype here. We're pretty excited to get our hands on here because this is the first time we're actually seeing it uh, where we can actually use the UI. So you can see that it is obviously running Windows 8 and you can see it looks like it has, from the number of apps here on the screen, it looks like it has a full HD display. Definitely has one actually. Um, it does have a detachable mechanism, but I'm just going to lift it up. It looks really, it, it feels really quite light. Let's just take a look at the dock down here. So you can see that there is that's the support around the back. Let's take a look there. So there's two USB 3.0s. We have a mini HDMI and a, looks like a display port. There don't, there don't appear to be any other ports uh, around the unit. But let's just take another look around the front. Nothing here. Actually, why don't I detach it? There's actually a detaching mechanism right here. So you press it here. And the green light's on. And then we take it out. It feels actually lighter than a lot of Culver Trail tablets that I have had in my hands. Uh, down here on the bottom, you can see that there, there is a micro uh, SD card there, and then as well as the docking mechanisms here. If we keep on looking around the tablet, I don't really see much else. Although the back is, is really quite cool. So at the top there, we have looks to be like a power button, and then we have the volume rocker. It's not the power button, it's the... It's the yeah, the display rotation, you can see it there. Uh, so then this must be the power button over there. We won't press it because this is quite a... This is a prototype, we don't want to jinx things. And then we have a headphone jack there. And we don't have really have much else. On the back you can see that we do have a camera as well as a uh, LED flash it looks like. So just discussing Haswell a little bit, we're expecting to see a whole truckload of Haswell uh, detachables, ultrabooks, and the rest of it at Computex in June. And what we're expecting to see is the same processing power as Ivy Bridge, double the graphics, and a significant battery jump in savings. So it's, we're, we're supposed to be seeing a very, um, very, very large extension in battery life thanks to this platform. So we're really excited to see uh, Haswell come to market. And uh, we're going to be at Computex, obviously, because we are based in Taipei, Taiwan. I'm Nicole Scott from Mobile Geeks, taking a first look at Haswell.